Hi everyone. Today I'm going to present the title of the Learning Mathematics from Coding to Computational Thinking Truth Computational Mathematics Problem Based Learning, which is called CMPBL. Billions of people connected by a mobile device, autonomous vehicle with artificial intelligence, digital fabrication, technologies are emerging change. Learners have spent their entire lives on the digital music players, video games, mobile devices, and all other tools of the digital age. How many of the learners do really understand how these computers, software, games, and mobile applications work? Through the learning basic coding, it's able to help learners to understand how these teach how these tech gadgets work. According to the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, average annual STEM job growth through 2026 years, computing occupied 68.8%, while software developers occupy 37.6%, which is more than one third out of the total of STEM jobs. From this pie chart, combinations of the computing and mathematics is 75.1%, which is occupied three quarters of total STEM jobs. Here, we can see how important of mathematics and computing in our future STEM jobs. All these countries already implemented coding in their education curriculum. MOE of Malaysia is going to integrate coding into education curriculum. MOE of Malaysia organized Hour of Code HOC campaign since the 2017. HOC is an hour activity where students were introduced to the basic of coding and computer science where students were, were able to solve the problem through the gamification. The current issues of the mathematics subject is students able to do the basic arithmetic but fail to compute two or more steps of complex situation. Students unable to construct the knowledge due to only understand superficial of mathematic concept. Current education is not only teach reading, writing or arithmetic and how to use technology literacy skills, these skills are required for sustainability and a lifelong education in addition to basic education. See this negative attitude towards the mathematics growth with the age and perceive. Mathematics as hard, boring and cost a poor take up of advanced mathematics. Current instruction is insufficient in nurturing students ability to solve and identify mathematical problems in context, which able to uncover information needed and stimulates students' knowledge to solve the problems. Issues for those countries already implemented coding curriculum, they raise up the issue of overlook the other skills such as algorithmic thinking and problem skill and problem solving debugging, we will seek for alternative way of teaching complex problem solving skills and providing the dynamic learning experience. Dota Scratch, the code do RG, the Arduino block, the M block, and the Alice are the drag and drop online tools for coding. It can be used to assess CT skills through the several metrics as a valid measurement for the complexity of software system. This comprises of a six general city concept, which are the naming, procedure, abstraction, variables, loops, conditioners, list. Analysis the questions are classified by the six cities classes, which were process and the transformations. And models and the abstraction, patterns and the algorithm, tools and resources, inference and logic, evaluations and improvements, 
and the higher level of the city depends on the complexity of the game design. The web-based programming environment that allows the learners to write, run, and share the programs on the web is, is typically interactive, provides special support for word, for world programs that can interact with timers, tick, keyboards, events, and the images. Okay, the below are the literature review of the problem-based learning. The problem-based learning is part of this tradition where the students learn by the problems and reflecting on their experience by investigate, justify, and resolve the real-world problems. Problem-based learning is described as an instructional strategy in which the students learn through the facilitated by integration of the pure knowledge in problem solving that focus on a complex problem that does not have a single final solution. Learners develop strategies to attain the knowledge and construct the cross-discipline knowledge. Students more likely to use hypothesis driven reasoning to explain a clinical problem by identifying what they need to know during the problem solving process. There are the few researchers having a general agreement that the problem-based learning is an effective instruction in promoting students' problem-solving skills, which is the skills fundamental to lifelong learning. And below here are the literature review of the problem-solving. The problem-solving quoted that solving a problem means finding a way out of a difficulty, a way around an obstacle, Attaining an aim that was not immediately understandable. And the Green, Allison, and the Gil Holly stated that problem solving in all its manifestation is an activity that structures everyday life in a meaningful way. Kuma and the Sherwood stated that simulation can be helpful in improving the understanding of complex concepts because computer simulations provide an external framework which facilitates learners interacting and visualizing with complication information involved in a problem. A requirement for a computing device is introduced by the Brown and the Stephenson who stated that the essence of a city refers to have using computers with the purpose of solving problems and counter. Current traditional education is still important and effective, but due to the technology rapidly growth, we have to revise our education become more interactive. Importance of the teaching computational thinking to school actually is now globally recognized because computational thinking represents a universally applicable attitude and skill set everyone, not just because scientists but it will be eager to learn and use. City defined the operational thinking as a process of problem solving so that the message processing agent can be effectively executed and the problem solved is focused on how people solve the problem using computer. Meanwhile, learners may develop strong mental models and others all kinds of things to get done in a broader range of discipline. Cities Vocabularies that can be used to annotate the semantics understanding of computational process are abstraction, automation, analysis, which are useful for the understanding how learners can use a computational thinking to formulation of a problem. This is the goal of the problem-based learning designed to help the students. This is the goal of the Computational thinking, which are the problem solving skills, the analytical skill, the increased concentration knowledge retention, the fundamental skill, not the root skill, complements and combines the mathematical and the engineering thinking. And here are the CMPBLs. We are involved with the POLAS problem solving skill and the problem based learning and the computational thinking and the mathematical thinking. Okay, this is the theoretical framework of the CMPPL, which is the combination of the problem solving technique from the polar 
problem based learning from the hemisphere, computer thinking from the gender wing, mathematical thinking from the scan skill to enhance the problem solving skill in learning mathematics. The combination of the computational thinking and the mathematical thinking is useful heuristic reasoning to discover a solution. Theoretical framework of the CMPPR encourages the learners to greater understanding, find more enjoyable and satisfying truth this active learning. Traditional literacy skills are reading, writing and arithmetic, but 21st century literacy are the media, information, technology, students need to use the media literacy skills in telecommunications and technology literacy to access that resources and through the information literacy skills to recognize what information is required. 21st century learning skills are foreseen which are the creativity, critical, collaboration and communication. Thank you. These are the reference of my research.